Hey guys, it's Hunter from Surf Lake Country here at Skipper Buds Pewaukee to show you guys the 2023 Mastercraft XRS. Without further ado, let's check it out. Just take a look around, tell me what you see. Outside here we got this triple axle trailer, we got the gold decal on the side, the XRS logo, this black and this gray color looks awesome on it. This boat came with the optional cove cover to maximize your bimini overhang when you're just laying out on the lake, it's perfect. Coming around back here you can see the Mastercraft surf star system and there's hydraulic actuators here that extend down for the metal plates so that you can customize your wave very easily. We've also got a nice transom ladder so you can hop up on the swim deck nice and easy to get in. We got these sweet transom lounge seats for perfect for laying out when you're having some lunch or just sitting chilling on the lake. Right here you got your ski pylon. Push it down, twist it, pops right up. Real nice and easy to use. Push it down, twist it, and then right here you got your foot back seat. Perfect for watching the riders while you're surfing. And you can even pick it up and lay it all the way down. So you've got a nice area right here for everyone to lay out. All right, now we're on the interior of the boat. We've got two subwoofers in this boat, one under the driver's seat, one up front, two speakers in the bow, another speaker here, one speaker on each side, and then we've got two speakers right on the dash here that come off the windshield, which is perfect for the driver and passenger. And in by the cup holders, We've got a nice phone holder right here. You can just slide your phone right in, and it's a wireless charger to keep your phone nice and out of the elements. You've got this nice step in the seat so you never step on your vinyl coming into the boat. Tons of storage under the seats here. You got your integrated cooler under this seat. Bunch of storage coming all the way through to the front right here. So you've got a huge coffin storage that leads from bow to transom of the whole boat. We've got this nice wraparound windshield with a curvature to it. And then coming up front, bunch of storage under these going style seats, along with a designated anchor storage right on your center line. Here at the helm, you've got this awesome driver's seat with a bolster that just flips right up. You can even recline the backrest. And you've got your steering wheel, dual screen dash. Here's your wireless phone charger for the driver. Key switch. Then you got charging ports right here. A heater by your feet. And then we've also got a heater on each side of the boat that pulls out for passengers. Perfect for sticking under a towel to heat yourself up on a fall night. You've got the battery switch. Easy access. Got your uh, bow door to close it off. And then you got an integrated garbage can right here, which is perfect for keeping the boat free of clutter. Right here, we've got some nice surfboard uh, sleeves on the bimini, so you can easily strap your board up. And the board racks are so nice on Mastercraft. They swing right in super nice. Push the red button to let them loose. Push them up to tighten them. Keeps your boards tight, so you don't have to mess around with bungees. It's the best out of any boat. And then you've got a tow point on each side of the tower, because wake surfing is the most popular sport right now. So you hook up the rope on whichever side you surf on, starboard or port, and then the rope takes you right outside the wave so you don't got to battle with that whitewash in the middle. So you may be asking why it's dark colors on this boat. We got black and gray interior. It's actually because it's the cool feel by Mastercraft. This stays 30% cooler than other marine grade vinyls, and it's very nice and looks super stealthy in the black and gray interior. All right, we're here at the dual screens now. We got a nice backup camera for you. Shows your depth. Air temperature, water temperature, here's your gas level, engine hours, and on the right screen here, this is the touch screen. This is where you can do all your profiles and stuff for surfing, wakeboarding, and skiing. So if you want to surf, we'll go right here to surf, and it's just a slider scale from one to seven. One being the smallest mellow wave, and seven being the steepest big wave. The bigger the wave, the more push you're going to get. So a bigger person, bigger rider that wants to do tricks and stuff, you're going to put them on a bigger wave. Beginners, you're gonna to wanna to keep it down here at a one. 
because that's going to be smaller, less push. So all you do is click what number you want, and the boat's going to start filling up all the ballast for you. Set those metal tabs, the Surfstar system in the back, and it's going to set the speed for you. So all you do is press a button, let it fill up, and then you're ready to go. Crunch the throttle forward, and it's going to be set at your speed already. That's all you do. Same with wakeboarding. Choose your setting, beginning, intermediate, advanced. Good to go. Skiing, click ski, sets it for you, and you're good to go. And if you want to adjust stuff on the fly, you can go over to custom surf, and you can adjust the ballast levels, tab levels, your speed, and what side the boat's on. Here's the zone control. Zone control is so nice. Say somebody's talking in the front of the boat, then we'll turn the bow speakers down so it's going to be quiet up there so they can talk and hear each other. And if the rider wants it super loud, we'll turn the tower speakers up so they can hear the music behind the boat. We've got our lights here. So right now we got the courtesy lights and then we got the speaker lights on. So the courtesy lights, you can see speaker ones are around the speaker rims and then courtesy ones you get by the floor and then in by the cup holders, which looks super awesome at night. Come in here, we got our bilge. These are gonna be automatically set on. So if you do start taking in water, they're gonna start kicking water out. The blower turns on automatically for the first couple minutes when you turn the key on. That just lets some fumes out of the engine. Heaters, like I showed you before, those pull out tubes. Click those on, that'll turn the heater on. And then if you do option to get the passenger driver seat heated, that would be right here to turn those on. New for Mastercraft, they have a stern thruster. So you can easily adjust the stern thruster by just twisting the top of the throttle here to pivot the boat one way versus the other. It's perfect for picking up riders. Thanks for checking out this Mastercraft XRS with us. If you're interested in this boat or any other Mastercrafts, be sure to check it out at Skipper Bus Pewaukee. Thanks for watching guys, see you next time.